It's the Crypto Lightsaber back with another video, guys. We're going to talk about Zen Crypto and why I believe it may be the bottom and time to start buying Zen Crypto potentially for a pump or for the bull run. Okay, guys. Um, Zen is recently or is recently being announced, sorry, by KuCoin that they will now be listing Zen Crypto, as you can see on on the Jack Levin tweet right here, just a few hours ago, four hours ago. Okay, guys, so that could mean bullish price action for Zen. Doesn't mean it's going to happen straight away. Obviously, when Bitcoin dominance comes down and we see the altcoins start to take off, Zen could be one of those tokens that takes off along with the rest of the altcoins. Okay, guys. And another reason is if we look at the chart, a lot of other tokens went and listed Zen at the really at the wrong time. Okay, you could say it's, it was the right time because it brought a lot of exposure, but. They listed Zen at the top, okay, guys? So a lot of people probably would have got wrecked if they were buying it on centralized exchanges, but Qcoin has waited it out, and they're listing it now when it's at the bottom, okay, guys? So if you zoom out, you say this could potentially be the bottom of the Zen chart. We had a long dump from the top, okay, near its beginning. If we just zoom out a little bit more, okay? So a massive, massive dump, massive dump, massive dump, okay? And of course... People were minting this for free, okay, guys? So, you know, really a lot of people still made money, okay, guys? Um, but right now, what we're seeing is the selling could be over for Zen, at least right now, okay? Obviously, we had this pump out of nowhere um, a little while back. That was over a 10x. Let's just do a measured move. Um, that was over almost 12x okay almost 12x or maybe a little bit more than 12x if we actually um you know measured it properly okay guys but what do we see here it looks like it could be an 80 to 90 percent dump from the previous high okay guys at the time of recording this video it's at 83 percent down it did come 86 percent down okay guys so that would suggest this could be the bottom if it's not the bottom then it's very near the bottom Okay, guys, and if it did come down a little bit further, we would see a double bottom being formed on this chart. Okay, but with KuCoin listing this now, I would suggest that this could potentially be a bottom for Zen, and we could start seeing a bullish accumulation of Zen. All it means is that with KuCoin listing this very big exchange, means that a lot more volume could come into this project, and it's highly likely, or always more probable that people will be buying Zen rather than selling Zen off the back of this news because at the end of the day, it's listing at the bottom. Okay, guys. So that is a bullish update uh, update for Zen Crypto. I know my last video on Zen wasn't as bullish. Okay, guys. But ultimately, we do see the founder of Zen doing a lot of other things. However, what we also have is we have the, the Zen or the X1 blockchain soon to be launched, I believe. I saw a tweet from Jack Levin, a video... And he was showing how fast the transactions are on the Zen blockchain or the X1 chain. Uh, but that will have another token called XN. And um, in order to get XN, I believe that people are going to be burning Zen if they're not already. Okay, if you've burnt Zen FTs or if you've burnt Zen to get into other projects, you will get an airdrop for the XN token. Um, but yeah, I mean, will that make the Zen crypto token irrelevant? Probably not. Jack Levin is probably going to find some way to make it even more bullish somehow. Okay, guys, but, you know, people are going to be debating whether you want to be holding the Zen Crypto token or you want to be holding the XN token because the XN token is going to be the gas token on the Zen blockchain. Me, personally, I would have preferred if the Zen Crypto token, this token Zen, would have been the gas token on the Zen blockchain. Okay, but, um, you know, I'm not the founder. I'm not the, the developer. Okay, guys, but... um. In a nutshell, we do have things coming, which could be a bullish catalyst for this. Okay, guys. And of course, KuCoin once again have listed it. Who knows if Binance would end up listing Zen as well? Of course, it depends on volume. The volume is not that great. Okay, 6.65K in 24 hours, which is not a lot. Okay, that's not a lot of volume at all. All right, guys. But um, yeah, with a KuCoin listing on the horizon... Could that bring a lot more volume into this token? We'll have to wait and see. But um, yeah, I do believe we are due for an altcoin pump. Okay, guys. So I have bought a bunch of Zen. 
and then let's see what happens with this particular rally okay guys so that's really all i've got for you in this video if you're not subscribed to the channel do me a favor and subscri subscribe tick the little bell for notifications like the video which helps with the youtube algorithm and i'll see you in the next video